Hello and welcome back. Thanks so much for staying with us. Now, we do have a weak trough that is, that is just towards the southeast of Jamaica. We do also have some cloudy conditions offshore the southeast coast. There is also a frontal system. This is a stationary front. It extends across Cuba. We can see a distinct line of clouds across the area. It extends into the Yucatan. We're not expecting significant movement with this stationary front. It is likely to be generating showers across Cuba over the next couple of days as it rains out across the area. But we still have stable conditions expected and governing most of the central and eastern portions of the Caribbean basin. Expect partly cloudy skies tonight across sections of the east as temperatures drop to 24 degrees Celsius. We're expecting clouds also in the morning tomorrow across the east for the afternoon clouds as well. High temperature in Kingston 32, high in Montego Bay 33 degrees Celsius. Now the breakdown has generally sunny conditions expected across most of the southeast tomorrow. We're expecting it to be partly cloudy in the afternoon in Mandeville as well as in Santa Cruz, Savannah, Lamar and Negril. Windy conditions prevail across the northeast in Port Antonio and Port Maria. Also for Ocho Rios, St. Anne's Bay, Brownstown and Falmouth, we're expecting those strong winds across the area while it's partly cloudy in the afternoon in Montego Bay and in Lucy. Now this Friday and Saturday, expect isolated showers across mainly eastern portions of the island as well as inland areas otherwise. We're not dropping those winds. They're expected to remain strong anywhere between 15 and 20 knots across the area while on Thursday and on Wednesday it's partly cloudy in the afternoons. For the marine forecast on the north coast tomorrow, winds are northeasterly at 15 to 20 knots. On the south coast tomorrow, slightly weaker winds as that trough system is lingering through the area. We expect them out of the southeast at 10 to 15 knots with wave heights reaching one meter, while for offshore areas, we're expecting east northeasterlies at 15 to 20 knots as wave heights reach two meters. There are currently no small craft warnings in effect. We're expecting easterlies to prevail across the area on Wednesday, averaging 15 knots, and then on Thursday and Friday, they pick up to 20 knots out of the east. Sunset in Kingston tomorrow is at 16 past 6 and at 22 past 6 in the grill. That's it for the weather report and forecast this evening. We thank you so much for watching.